Hello, this is Taya Gurken with Peghead Nation, and I'm here to show you Fishman's new Rare Earth Mic Blend Pickup. I have it installed in this uh, Taylor 712C here, so you just heard me play a little bit of fingerstyle with this pickup. But I also want to just kind of go over the features and uh, explain how this pickup works to you a little bit. Fishman's offered its line of Rare Earth pickups uh, for a long time. They're all sound hole pickups, uh, magnetic sound hole pickups, and they've even had a Rare Earth blend for some time. Uh, but earlier this year, they've uh, reintroduced the pickup with some new features, so it's worth taking another look. Like the uh, Rare Earth uh, blend has always been, the, Ra the Rare Earth mic blend combines a magnetic pickup, uh, sound hole pickup, um, that's basically the same as the standard Rare Earth without the uh, built-in microphone, with um, a miniature microphone on a gooseneck. And it's a very cool combination because you, you add the two very distinctively different sounding sources into one uh, that can be just used with a regular uh, mono guitar cable. There's a blend control on the pickup itself. It's this little wheel right here. It's easy to access even uh, through the sound hole if I had it, uh, if I was doing it in, in the installed pickup. And I mentioned the mic is on a gooseneck. Uh, it's an active design. It's powered by two little uh, button batteries right here. And uh, the added feature to this pickup this year is a new switch that is a low cut switch for the microphone. And that's a great feature in case your guitar is really uh, boomy or you're playing at high volumes where having a lot of low end on the guitar might be a problem. Um, so having this little switch on here, uh, which I'll demonstrate to you later, is really a great new feature to have on this pickup. They've also made the gooseneck a little bit shorter. On earlier versions, it was quite long and it sometimes kind of flopped around the inside of the body. It was easy to kind of touch the touch parts of the body with it. So I think this is actually better with the uh, shorter gooseneck on the mic. And as always, the pickup is very easy to install. Uh, there are just two uh, screws on each side and it, um, it's padded with cork so it just clamps right into the sound hole. It can be done very fast. Uh, as you might see here right now, I have it installed temporarily in my guitar. The cable is dangling out the sound hole. Um, that's one of the attractive features about a sound hole pickup. You can temporarily install it without any modifications to the guitar. If you were going to do this uh, more permanently, I would suggest you install it with an end pin jack, a standard end pin jack on the uh, guitar, uh, which is uh, better than having it dangle out of the guitar um, and a little bit safer. Uh, but either way is a good option with this uh, unit. The pickup uses new dimium magnets. Um, they're under the cover. There's no adjustment uh, pole pieces on here because it really features a great balance between the strings um, right out of the gate. Um, and uh, I found, for example, with this, I'm, I'm tuned to a low C here with low C tuning. And regardless of whether I'm in an alternate tuning or uh, standard tuning, the, the pickup balances beautifully with this. And it really reproduces uh, the lows of, of this tuning, as you probably heard when I was playing very nicely, which is one of the things that magnetic pickups do well. They really handle low tunings uh, and sort of low frequencies in general very well. The Rare Earth Mic Blend uses a humbucking design. Um, so it's very quiet in its operation, and it has a very nice um, full range response uh, to, to the strings of the guitar. Of course, it does only work with steel strings. That should be mentioned. You can't use this with a nylon string guitar. That's the case with any sound hole pickup. Uh, but again, having the combination of the pickup and the microphone gives you a very uh, full spectrum sound. One um, feature about this that's also very cool is that uh, you can use a stereo cable, a tip ring sleeve cable, either with a tip ring sleeve on both ends or a Y cable that splits into different channels. And you can actually uh, process the magnetic portion and the microphone portion separately. So you could have your, um, your sound mixer uh, process the mic and the pick up in different ways, EQ them separately, separately, and really optimize the sound that way. That's not something a lot of people do, but it's great to have that option, and it would also be really powerful to have if you're using this to record in the studio. Let me demonstrate the pickup a little bit more for you. I'm uh, using a standard mono cable here, and I'm going through a Fishman Loudbox mini amplifier. And I'll just show you how the different settings sound and uh, demonstrate a couple of different playing styles. OK, so when you heard me demo the pickup in the uh, intro to this video, I had the uh, blend setting right in the middle so that um, the magnetic portion of the pickup and the microphone are split 50-50, uh, which is what, what it is right now for uh, comparison. 
Uh, let's see what it sounds like with the setting completely to the pickup with no microphone, uh, which is something that might come in handy if you're playing very loud. Uh, if you have loud stage monitors, you may not be able to use a lot of the internal mic because uh, feedback could become a problem. So it's really good to have the option of blending in just as much of the mic as you uh, can use or want to use. So right now, this is the pickup without any of the microphone. <laughs> So that's just magnetic pickup. I'm going to, just for comparison, dial it back to the in-between position. And now I'm going to dial it in so that it's, um, let's see if I can go to just microphone right now, uh, which... You can tell that might be a, a little bit boomy sounding. It would be rare that you would use only the mic on this. It's great to have the option. Some dual source systems only allow you to add the microphone to the pickup rather than going all the way to the uh, microphone. So having the option is great. And certainly experimenting with the mic position inside the guitar um, would have a drastic effect on the sound of, of the microphone. And each instrument will also sound different. So with this guitar, I would probably not use a whole lot more than the 50-50 position. I think that's the best sound. It still allows me to uh, get percussive effects on the guitar, transmit it with the microphone. It gives a nice touch of air from the, uh, from the microphone that's added to the magnetic pickup sound. And also, um, the magnetic tends to do, be really good at uh, transmitting the lows in the bass response of the guitar, whereas the mic is great at delivering the highs. So the combination of the two uh, creates a nice full range sound. I'm going to use the use it uh, dialed into a little bit more microphone to show you the high cut switch and it's a little bit hard to hear um, here in the studio because we're not working with um, high volumes or with a uh, large system with just a little amp but uh, if I switch the switch this is um, with the uh, switch off Touch uh, less of a high end when I when I when I turn on the uh, the high high roll off. Um, again, it's a little bit hard to demonstrate here in the studio in a larger um, PA setting at higher volumes. Uh, it is a really excellent feature to have as it will drastically extend the, um, uh, the the usability of the microphone in the system at higher volumes. So those are some of the general features of the uh, Fishman Rare Earth Mic Blend. Uh, now, you heard me mostly play finger styles so far. A lot of people really like sound hole pickups um, for playing with a pick, because they do tend to have kind of a warmer attack on the strings than some other pickups. And depending on your technique, uh, it can really yield a great sound. And uh, that combined with the ability to play at high volumes without feedback issues, particularly when you're using mostly the magnetic pickup, make these a great choice for playing in a band. Um, so let me just show you a little bit what this system sounds like when I'm strumming the guitar with a flat pick. <laughs> So that's the new Fishman Rare Earth Mic Blend. It's great to see Fishman uh, continuing to improve and tweak existing products. Um, it's a great sounding pickup for a lot of different playing styles, really. Um, it's something that you actually can try in the store. You can do a temporary installation like I did with this here and uh, see what it sounds like with your particular setup. Um, it works with pretty much any steel string guitar that has a, a sound hole. Um, works with most size sound holes and uh, really adds a lot of flexibility to your sound by being able to do the microphone and the magnetic pickup in one package with a simple blend right here on board. So check them out um, and please come visit us here for more gear demos on Peghead Nation. My name is Taya Gurken. <laughs>